Hi there, welcome to our demo featuring Whistler, a 32 gigabits per second multi protocol series IP designed for the toughest high speed interface challenges. Now, let me ask have you ever hit a wall in your design where the space is so tight that the only workaround is cramming in multiple series blocks just to handle all the signals from many different protocols? Trust me, we have been there too. That's exactly what this demo is about. This demo showcases how Wi-Fi can support multi protocols simultaneously and simplify your architecture for faster bring up, all without a need for multiple files. Let's dive in and show how Whistler helps you do more with less. Hello, my name is Nicholas Popovich, and I'm a lead design engineer on the product engineering group here at Cadence. Today, I will be demonstrating the multi protocol capabilities of Cadence's 32 gigabit per second Whistler IP. The board right now is configured in external loopback, save for two lanes, which are going to this Keysight UXR oscilloscope. I'll be controlling the board using this interface behind me here to emulate the signals usually sent by the controller. For this demo, the PCIe side of the PHY will use PLL0 to lock to an 100 MHz reference clock signal, while the Ethernet side of the PHY will use PLL1 to lock to an 156.25 MHz signal. Port 0 will use lane 0 through 3 for PCIe operation and will be brought up to PCIe Gen 5, operating at 32 gigabit per second speeds. Port 1 will be configured for Ethernet use and use lanes 4 through 7. This port will be brought up to Ethernet 25 GKR speeds. Now that the board has been brought up, you can see both the 32 gigabit PCIe link on the top and the 25 gigabit Ethernet link on the bottom. Now that these links have been brought up, I can go ahead and request a rate change on the PCIe link to go from Gen 5 down to Gen 4. Now that this rate change has been completed, we can see that the top link is now operating at 16 gigabit per second, while the 25 gigabit Ethernet link is still going uninterrupted. Similarly, I can request an Ethernet rate change to go down to 10G operation. Now that the Ethernet rate change is complete, we can see that the Ethernet lane is operating at 10G speeds while the PCIe lanes have been uninterrupted. Thank you for watching this demo. If modern SOC's flexibility isn't optional, it's essential. Cadence Whistler IP delivers exactly that, a unified file solution capable of running multiple protocols at once. Silicon proven across seven nanometer to three nanometers is one of the industry's most trusted series solutions. Choosing a multi protocol file isn't just smart, it's strategic advantage. To see how Whistler and other Cadence IP can elevate your next innovation, visit us at cadence.com to unleash your imagination and build products at the leading edge of technology.